Hello guys, welcome to my class. Today we are going to learn how to design and analyze shear wall according to IS 456. Okay, you can change the code. So, you have to know first what shear wall. Shear wall basically, basically shear wall is the system to resist wind and seismic loads. Okay. So, under different types of segment or platform shear wall design you can change the code or you, know, you can change the thickness you can change the data okay so let's start at first open step pro click on new project click on space you can give a name length unit meter for me and four unit kilometer then next okay then click on add beam or you can directly go to the open structure with a main method for creating a frame model okay and finish now here is the frame model i am going to give bay take bay frame for decreasing the tutorial time okay now length unit 12 b4 height 15 now of height you can decrease it to 12 to 4 as a four story building and apply it now this is your structure and transfer model to step for yes coordinate 000, zero, zero. Uh, this is our frame so at first we are going to support the structure for that go to form view go to support page click on create and fix support add it select the support select the nodes and click on the selected node assign yes now this is our structure and we have to create share wall or surface for that we go to add surface first we have to decide where we give the share wall okay you can give the share wall on four side or two side i'm going to give give the share wall on z direct z positive di di direction one side only okay so we're going to if i select here you will be mistaken and you will overlap or you select the wrong node okay so go to the top view select only this portion sorry top view select only this portion by beam cursor select this portion see positive the direction and go to view view selected object only and you see this is the only portion and we are going to create surface now so add click on add surface and if you want to give want to create surface here so you can create surface here if you want to here you can create here so add just the four nodes selecting plate cache eh, in sorry surface add surface just add the nodes and where you start it finish it now here is your surface one surface we are going to give that these floors also so add the nodes similarly as the first one you added ok now our shared wall is ready and view the whole structure view the whole structure select this display whole structure and this is your structure 
okay now i'm going to keep the property so go to property page go to thickness and see the surface thickness select the surface thickness give the thickness 0.2 okay then add it close and select the surface and select the shear wall or the surface by surface cursor select the surface is cursor and click on ascend to select a surface assign it yes now our surface cursor is assigned you can check in the 3d interview this is our shear wall you can change the thickness double click on the surface thickness you want to give to 5 change it okay and give the property for the rest of the structure to define rectangle i'm going to give 3 by 1 to 5 for the rest of the structure add it close it then close the restructure by beam cursor select the beams for the structure click on the selected beams sign is okay go to the 3 interview and the whole structure property has been given and you have to give some loads for that go to load page click on load test detail click on add loading type date give title date add it and live add it click on dead load add self word add okay. and for the surface load click on the surface load if you want to give concentrated load you can give the concentrated loads self word shear surface what you need okay i'm going to I'm going to go to pressure on full surface i'm going to give one kilometer per meter square in the local z direction okay then add it close it self point goes to the whole structure and the surface load goes to the surface wall select surface plate select the surface okay then assign to selected surface and if you want to check the load you have to select clip apply immediately and decrease it and you see the loads how the loads working on the wall okay now goes to the live load add Live load doesn't need it, you can delete it. Okay, now have to analyze it. Go to analyze here, analyze, no print, add, close, analyze, analyze, save. So there is some good news, there is no error, no warning, no notes. So your analyze is perfect for the modeling part. Go to done and you have to design it. For then go to design and I will design the shear wall and select the shear wall. Select shear wall and you can see the surface panel. This is surface 1 that is selected, surface 2 this is selected surface 3 here is surface 3 here is the surface 4 so for the surface 1 click on the surface 1 click on create panel and you see only the surface 1 surface 1 is shown ok now what you have to do just close the nodes so first second third fourth okay now the 
just select the close area and panel type will be over it because we are going to design the shear work ok now see our first panel is complete again go to the shear wall option this is 5 panel 1 completed you can see again go to the surface tool that is selected if I click on create panel see only create panel 2 is showing the figure you can check it this is 3 meter 6 meter first distance to is 0 to 3 second floor is 3 to sorry first floor the ground floor is 0 to 3 first floor is 3 to 6 this is 3 to 6 you can check it now just select the nodes and panel type wall ok now again click on the share wall similarly surface 3 create panel just close the node panel time wall ok share wall for surface 4 create panel panel type wall ok now our share wall share wall panel is complete ok now we have to design it share wall design you can see client code I am going to give code IS456. Okay. Now select parameters for shear wall design. I am going to select clear cover. Okay. Compressive strength and EL strength. Then click on OK. Define the parameters which I have selected. 0.025. Add it. Click enter or you can add it. FC 20,000 add it and if I mean 415 add it close it and you can see the parameters here ok first clear cover it goes to the whole structure as in to view similarly the compressive strain goes to the whole structure and the yield strength sorry delete the FI main and define the parameter for FI main showing that if you done something wrong you can change it here ok it goes to the assigned to plan now go to comments you can see there is only one option this share design share wall as we design the only the share wall add it close it ok now select design share wall now select the surface by surface cursor and click on assign the selected surface assign is yes. now go to analyze analyze perform analyze ok analyze analyze save you can see there is warning which is for the we have deleted the L strength that is for the warning ok go to the output file you can see the warning see only first use you don't have to worry for that ok so this is our in output sorry is the result share all design this is our output this is output ok this is the tire 22 8 mm main uh, main bar distribution bar ok 
you can go to the post processing okay you can see the surface stresses maximum absolute apply okay you can check the stresses like that you can go to the report you can select all the report or you can go to the output okay and then the reaction summary you can go to the reaction okay fail member table you can add uh, whatever you need for output get corner tail split center traces okay property forces beam maximum moment displacement beam dial and you can go to whole is available now is still to run we selected the whole output file okay and this is our output okay we will go on to the post processing and you can see the moments here and you can check the actual force and you can check the share force on y you can see the deflection beam stresses okay So that's it. That's how you're gonna design shear wall. Okay. If you want to change the ice code, you can change the ice code because in the previous videos I showed how to design on BS807, BS8110 different codes on how to design the design. Okay, so that's it and thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe on my channel and like on my channel okay please subscribe on my channel okay so bye